Hi, I'm Nita. Hi, I'm Katie, and welcome to MacKillop Catholic College. Let us show you around. Mr. Eamon Pollard is our current principal. Here are a few words of introduction from him. Hello to each one of you and thank you very much for enrolling at MacKillop. We've got lots of exciting years ahead. And we look forward to a close relationship with you over the next six years. Uh, the school's growing very rapidly and that means that there are all sorts of opportunities that are also growing rapidly. And you will be the largest cohort of Year 7s we've had in the history of the college. There will be something like 173 of you. You may have heard that there's been an announcement that MacKillop will be going to Years 11 and 12. It's commencing from 2023, which is very exciting. We still have a little bit of work to do in preparation for that. We need to get registered amongst other things. We are already very well organised and very much looking forward to having our first students in Year 11 and 12 in 2023 and that will of course impact on you in years to come. So we very much look forward to welcoming you to MacKillop for the first day of school next year. We have a vision statement which tells us we are a Christ-centred learning community which fosters excellence, compassion and service. Those three words, excellence, compassion and service, are really important to us. We're a Catholic school and we take that very seriously, as well as the need to care for each other. So we have a responsibility for the well-being of all, and especially those who are most in need. We have two deputy principals at MacKillop, Mrs Alison Stone and Miss Donna Brown. Hello and welcome to MacKillop Catholic College. My name is Mrs Alison Stone and I'm the new deputy principal you'll be able to complete all of your secondary schooling here at MacKillop. That means from 2023, you'll be able to choose to stay and we're going to transition into a year seven to 12 college. I look forward to you being a continuing part of the very special MacKillop community. Hi everyone, I'm Miss Brown. I'm Deputy Principal at MacKillop Catholic College. I've been at the college for five years now. I was previously Director of Pastoral Care and I've been Deputy Principal since March 2020. Here's some information that you need to know about buses, uniform, the canteen and your first day at MacKillop in 2021. Here's our formal uniform. We think it looks pretty smart. There's a few options available for both girls and boys. Just a heads up, most of our boys purchased and wear the shorts. We'd advise against buying the long pants at least until halfway through Term 1 when you might decide whether or not you want to have them for winter or whether you'd like to continue wearing the shorts, which a lot of our boys do. Take a look at our sports uniform now. Please note that the MacKillop spray jacket is not part of the formal uniform, hasn't been since 2016. The newer soft shell jackets can be worn over the sports uniform rugby jumpers and they also replace the blazer once you're at school. Most students travel to the college by bus and arrangements are now available from most areas. Buses stop at and leave from the Currajong Street side of the college. Metro bus services cover all Eastern Shore suburban areas from Opossum Bay to Bridgewater. Metro cards can be purchased through the Metro Tasmania website. We encourage families to do this well before school begins. Phone Metro on 13 2201 for more information. Tasmanian Red Line coaches service all areas from Cambridge to Fawcett with connections through Sorrell to Tassielink to the East Coast and the Tasman Peninsula. Phone Red Line on 1300 360 000 for more information. And Coal River Bus Service. Coal River services go out to all areas of Coal River Valley. Phone Coal River Buses on 0400 587 048. Custom Catering manages our canteen and provides a wide variety of healthy and tasty options for students. The canteen is open to all students during recess and lunch breaks. There is an option for counter sales, but the use of quicker and or FPOS facilities is strongly encouraged. Students under 18 can apply for debit cards at most financial institutions. All canteen transactions will appear on your bank statement as custom catering. All staff are very keen that when you first arrive here next year, you feel welcome, safe, engaged and connected. So the first day is set aside just for Year 7s. There will also be some Year 10 peer support leaders who will come along to help you. On your first day at MacKillop, you and your families will need to go to the sales area of the school where staff members will greet you and you'll be welcomed into the college in a really special way. There's nothing to worry about on your first day. It'll just be about getting to know the campus, the teachers and make some new friends. Here's some advice from our current Year 7s about your first few days at MacKillop. 
go into it with a positive mindset and you have like like the best year. You go up to everyone you see, say hello to them, ask their name and boom, you're friends. You don't have to be worried or anxious because you'll be fine and you'll be able to make friends really easily and everyone will be there to help you. Don't be nervous, it's not really that bad. You're going to be nervous at the first day but like everyone's really nice, you're going to meet new friends. Don't get lost and look at your timetable more. I would say just be open to doing something new. Oh, don't be nervous, it's not, not anything to be scared of, it's just another year at school and don't be scared to try anything. Just be confident and everyone's nice and welcoming. Just be yourself, uh, make heaps of friends and have fun. To not worry about anything, because when I came I used to worry about like work and your friends. Just be yourself and be friends with who you want to be friends with and don't be nervous, it all works out well. To just have a go at everything and know that even if something happens at McKillop it's okay to make mistakes. Expressing spirituality and faith is a really important part of going to a Catholic school and at McKillop Catholic College we do prayer every morning in tutor and that's a nice way to start the day. We offer prayer in St Joseph's Chapel every Friday morning before tutor and have the chance to attend Mass and participate in the liturgy. Learning at McKillop is engaging and provides us with lots of opportunities to extend ourselves or follow our interests. Students in Year 7 have six compulsory subjects, including Theology and Spirituality, English, Health and Physical Education, Humanities and Social Sciences, Mathematics and Science, as well as Enrichment subjects. At McKillop, you are really supported by teachers and staff to feel welcome. If you are worried about anything, there are lots of ways that the pastoral care team can help you. You can see the school counsellor or come and see Mr Aaron Davey, the Director of Pastoral Care. Welcome to McKillop College. My name is Aaron Davey and I'm the Director of Pastoral Care. We're really, really excited to have your son or daughter come into our college. Pastoral care is such an important thing in shaping our young people in particular, their physical, their social, their mental, emotional and spiritual health. Our pastoral care staff, starting with your tutor teacher, your year level coordinator and our wellbeing team are here to support your son or daughter through this challenging time. Specifically, our personal development program is tailored towards supporting them through this transition and exciting phase of their life. We hope they can make the most of the opportunities here at McKillop College and we look forward to taking them through all the way to year 12. Hello, my name is Jess Ages. I'm the Director of Learning, Enrichment and Extension. Our learning support team do a great job helping us out in class. There's always someone around to help us if we need it and there are quiet places in the school if we need some time out, like the hub or the library. Hello everyone, my name is Murray Herbert and I'm the e-learning coordinator here at McKillop Catholic College. So my role is to ensure that we get the best educational outcomes for students by using technology wherever possible to support their learning and their needs. And there are several ways that we achieve this goal. So the first way we address this is that as a school we provide a laptop to every student here at McKillop. The other piece of critical technology that we use here at McKillop is our learning management system or LMS and that is called Sector. Now, Sector has three arms, if you like, depending on the user. There's Sector Teach, which is, of course is what us teachers use to prepare content. There's Sector Learn, which the students use to engage with lesson content. And the third arm is Sector Engage, and that's the platform for parents to engage with the learning that's going on here at school. Mrs Fee Gapen is a sports coordinator at McKillop College. Her office is in the Kirby block and you can go visit her or email at her any time to chat about sports. There are heaps of sports to play at McKillop and Fee does a great job running the events. We play netball, football, soccer, tennis, basketball, cricket. There are also water polo, hockey, volleyball, badminton, futsal, squash and touch football teams. We have surfing, triathlon and equestrian events during the year and of course our swimming, cross country and athletics carnivals. Miss Philippa Coward is Head of Performance, Art and Design. In the Performing Arts and Design, students use the design process to inquire, plan, create and evaluate 
as you develop your confidence, communication, creativity and critical thinking. In Year 7, you will spend a full year learning visual art, drama, music, dance, food technology and materials design and technology in specialist spaces. This means in just one school week you could paint, build, cook, act, perform, dance and learn a new instrument. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you got a lot of information out of it. Can't wait to see you next year for your first year of high school and if you see me, come and say hi.